This tutorial provides search tips to help locate the websites you need for your academic research. A recent study found that three out of four students could not perform a well-executed search on Google. And in your life, your courses, your career, your home life, depends on being able to find information. The tips that I'm about to share with you will make you the one out of four that can perform a well-executed search on Google. The first tip is to use the site command. It's better to tell Google what types of sites you're looking for instead of just getting everything mixed together back. So if you want to focus on government sites, military sites, educational sites, or nonprofit sites, it's as easy as doing site colon dot gov or dot edu or whatever. You also have the option of searching within a specific page. So if I wanted to search all of Tri-C, I would do site colon and then the website for Tri-C. The second tip is to use quotations. If you search Google just typing in the word school choice, you get about 770 million websites back. However, if you put the terms in quotes, it says only pull back where school is in front of and next to the word choice, which is actually about 2 million websites. So using quotations will give you much more focused search results and you won't have to look through so many websites. The next tip is the minus sign. Sometimes you need to exclude terms from your search. Perhaps your instructor told you don't use Wikipedia. So if I wanted to search for bullying but not Wikipedia, I type in bullying minus Wikipedia. That way anything from the Wikipedia will no longer show. Your best bet is to use them all together. So if you can see my search of school choice in quotes, the site is a nonprofit and not using a Wikipedia. So let's see how this will all look. So searching Google, we can see if I do the original search of just school choice, right now you get 782 million websites. But if we use all of our tips, the quotations, the type of site, I want nonprofits. And I'm not allowed to use Wikipedias or any kind of wiki, so I'll just do minus wiki. We see now that I get about 2.3 million sites, so that has really focused down what I'm looking for. I still don't want to look through this many sites. My last tip is to add another term. What are you really looking for? So I'm looking for the history of school choice. Once I add that second term, I'm down to less than 200,000 websites that are focused on the history of school choice, all coming from nonprofit organizations. So you can see, using those three tips, I've really focused my results down. Just a few more tips before we leave. One is to use your library. You don't want to rely only on Google for a research paper or project. Your library can give you access to thousands of magazines, journals, newspapers, books, so be sure to visit the LibGuides at Tri-C and start with whatever discipline you're in. The next tip is to never cite Wikipedia. Your instructors will not be impressed if the resource that you chose for your paper was the Wikipedia. And the last tip is to talk to a librarian. We're happy to help you. We're here for you. And you can find out how to contact us by going to the link below. Good luck with your research.